And Akko needs to take care of the basketball. That's all they need to do for now is to bring the ball in. They go up top to Hodge. Hodge being met up top by Junmar. And Akko trying to use time here. Hodge wants the basketball. Trying to get it to Quinto. Back to Nunu. Banquero for three. Yeah, big shot. Oh! Puts it up and in. Chris Banquero with a three. What a big shot there by Banquero. We were just talking about him and Chris Ross a while ago. I was wondering there if that gamble of a steal opened things up for that ball swing to Banquero. Because if he, they didn't gamble and they just waited for Cliff Hodge to attack. It was a gamble by Ross. It's a gamble right there on the steal, which was really, could have been good on one hand. But then if it will open things up for a ball swing and an open jumper, that's a big risk that you, you know anyone would really have to take. And that was the one shot. If you're San Miguel Beerman, you wouldn't want to give up against the Meralco Bots. Meralco to gamble on the switch, whatever. Go to CJ. CJ fires the three. Oh! oh! He drains the three! What a game, Andre! Oh, what an answer by CJ Just Perez. Just love the way how both of these teams compete at a very high level. Oh my goodness! Just when he thought San Miguel was dead in the water. CJ Perez delivers for the pyramid. Take a look at it one more time. Clearly behind the three-point arc. That's another three. And CJ Perez with another big shot. And he has a total of 34, 34 points. 34 big points for CJ. What a big scoring night. No hesitation on the part of CJ. We were just talking about it. Would you expect San Miguel to take a quick two or an open three? But you put both together, it was a quick three. Oh, that's dangerous. Oh, Baquero gets fouled in that play. Well, that was a dangerous pass to CB. But Baquero's great hands to catch that ball, like even on the fly. Catch. Yes, that was like a, a running back getting for you from know, a quarterback, get, getting a pass from the quarterback. On the fly, he was in midair when he, he caught that one. He was in midair, and that was not an easy uh, catch to make because when he landed, the defense was right there. He could have turned the ball over by either traveling or losing that ball. Oh, Bacchero, this is the first one. This game is alive for the Beerman. Bacchero. One will make a two-point game. San Miguel has no timeouts remaining. Still a chance for the Beerman. That leaves it wide open for they, San Miguel. They have to get this rebound first. Remember, this Meralco boss is also, you know, fighting hard for those rebounds. San Miguel has to clear this rebound, and they have 20 seconds to make a basket. Banquero makes the second. No timeouts remaining for the Beerman. Healthy situation, both teams. CJ has it. Marshall steps back for the lead. Oh! oh Marshall, Marshall puts it up and in. Oh my goodness! Both shots came from the same area for San Miguel. One from CJ, the other one from Marshall Lassiter. We are just in awe right now. The shot making of both teams. And San Miguel down by four with 24 seconds remaining. Now up by one. Take a look at it one more time. Quinto bites on the fake and Marshall turns into Super Marshall and gets that three-point shot to fall. And that was not an easy shot to make, and San Miguel fans really enjoying this moment. The Beerman fans now standing up here. The big no-go. No. Baquero. They don't have time. CB 
That's a screen. Maqueto drives, layup. CB, oh, oh that rolls out. CJ gets it, and he gets fouled. Oh, my goodness. That was a tough, tough shot there. Chris Banquero almost made that shot. That's going to be two free throws for the Beermen. Unlikely. The Beermen are in this position right now after being down by four with seconds remaining. What a big wind up here for San wow. Miguel. Wow. Those two three point shots in the end. And this might be the momentum that they need in this series. Banquero had a nice... That's a good look for I mean, CB. It was really close. He attacked the basket well. It's just that he just couldn't make it. Just didn't fall. And it's going to be shots here for Marshall. So Marshall will head to the free throw line. Maratos, one thirty second one timeout. Second time out. It's just two free throws for uh, CJ Perez. One thirty second timeout remaining here for the Miracle Bolts. Big free throws coming up here for Perez. CJ first one. Oh, that goes out. <laughs> free throws for both squads. For both squads. They're missing free throws. On one side, Chris Banquero missed one, split his charities. Now Brandon Bates coming into the floor as well as Jumar Fajardo for rebounding purposes. Again, Miralco has another 30-second timeout remaining. What a game so far. Just so unpredictable. You thought that one team had it in the bag already, but for some reason, the other team kept fighting back. Beerman, CJ Perez missed the first one. Second free throw. Perez misses it. Misses it intentionally. Bonquinto. That's going to be a travel of Bonquinto. And that's the game. What a turn of events here. Meraco was about to go up 2 0. But CJ Perez and Marshall Lasseter. They say lightning doesn't strike twice, but for the San Miguel Beerman, it, it does today. It did. They, same they hit spot. hit the three-point shot in the same spot. And that is the ball game as Meraco loses this one. And the Beerman wins this in amazing fashion.